three, then pull. Right, you turn. Do a double six. Right. Actually, it's part of your a little bit more. Have to see that? So drop right here and the rest of it. Okay. Um, Rose Selenagi is, uh, I'm going to show you from a, uh, a uh, turn that when you turn away from them, you're going to drop into the Selenagi this one, like this. So the move, as you went over the entire night, was uh, one, two, three, big steps to drop here like this. Now we've done it in steps, now we're going to put it together. What we're going to do is we're going to move all together by taking right, left, right, big step, big pull, and you're going to turn your whole body now. When you turn your whole body, this leg's going to trail, going to go with your body, it's going to get here. And you're going to drop down with the Sianagi position. Don't forget, position is back straight, 30 degrees, head forward, shoulders forward, you're here like this, weight's on the front part of your foot, and you're dropping low here like this. That's a good position right here. This position, from this side, here, head forward, don't drop your head, keep your head up, down, like that. So, when you're moving, it looks like this. One, two, three, boom, and you jump into it. Just like it's in the rest of it, you go right over. Now, when you jump, you sink. You sink. Right, left, right, you turn. Do a single sink. And then he'll, he'll go right over. Bam, the rest of it is easy. This arm is here, here, down, and then bam. Just drop your head, turn your shoulder a little bit, he'll go right over. Just like that. So here. Right, left, right. Now, sorry, yeah. Stop. Right, left. Big pull. Sorry, yeah. This pull, turn your head. This drives up. Here. Now, let me show you this arm, the Morote Sanagi, the double arm. Here's what it should be. When you're throwing this, when you pull this arm up, oftentimes people don't, they think this arm goes under the armpit. It doesn't. It actually goes, turn it a little bit, when you pull out, when you drop, your arm actually is part of your uh, forearm goes, and it's near your elbow, more or less, because uh, you know, it's bicep. That's where it should land. It should land there, and your, your, your hand should be in front of you, basically. It should never be back here. Back here, you can hurt your shoulder. If I turn in and he pulls back, I hurt my shoulder. But when I turn, the big turn is going on me, I say, go here, I drop this, this arm. It goes right on his bicep, and here's a little trick. Tricks of the trade, turn your wrist in like this. What does that do? That collapses and strengthens your whole body because it makes your, your shoulder one unit. You go like this, and that's very strong. So when you end up this way, this little motion here, as I turn, that I turn my wrist, will take him off balance a little bit more. Has to see that? So drop right here, and the rest of it goes right over. Just a turn, boom, he goes over. He tried again. So when you focus on this one, this just slides over. As it slides, your wrist turns forward like that. So you can see the, for the palm of your hand in front of your face, and your arm should be almost in front of you like this. It should never be back here. So here, good grip on the sleeve for the pull this way. Grab here, so it's one, Two, three, big pull. Again. <laughs> One, two, three. Go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Go. Right this down. I give it a shot.